greeting HMC friends and a very special blessing on this Ash Wednesday as once again we begin this journey of Lent this journey of remembering who we are that's going to culminate in the glory and the celebration of the resurrection on Easter Sunday. And so this morning I want to share the reading that is set for this week. Psalm 32 Blessed is the one whose transgressions are forgiven, whose sins are covered. Blessed is the person whose sin the Lord does not count against them, and whose spirit is no deceit. When I kept silent, my bones wasted away, through my groaning all day long. For day and night your hand was heavy upon me, my strength was sapped as in the heat of summer. Then, I acknowledged my sin to you, and you did not cover up my iniquity. I said, I will confess my transgressions to the Lord, and you forgave the guilt of my sin. Therefore, let everyone who is godly pray to you while you may be found. Surely when the mighty waters rise, they will not reach them. For you are my hiding place. You will protect me from trouble and surround me with the songs of deliverance. I will instruct you and teach you in the way you should go. I will counsel you and watch over you. Do not be like the horse or the mule, which have no understanding, but must be controlled by a bit and bridle or they will not come to you. Many are the ways of the wicked, but the Lord's unfailing love surrounds the one who trusts in God. So rejoice in the Lord, and be glad, you righteous. Sing all you who are upright in heart. And this is the word of God for the people of God. And thanks be to God. And so this journey of Lent that we begin today is a journey which we celebrate and we remember the forgiveness and the new life that Christ gives to us. It's almost the story as we begin today, like a Good Friday to an Easter Sunday. And so today, at the beginning, it is a little bit more difficult as we come to remember who we are and some of those realities that it is from dust that we have been created and it is to dust that we shall return. The remembrance that we are mortal. The remembrance that we have failed God. And so that ash cross marks the beginning. But it's not the whole story. It's only the beginning. For the whole story is a story of repentance. Not just repentance. Repentance that has forgiveness. What an incredible gift that is given to us by God. And so today, as we begin and maybe make that decision to give something up, the reality is not that it is Puritan or that we should suffer. 
But for example, if I've given up coffee, and each time I would love just to have a cup, it would remind me of the forgiveness of God. And what a joyful reminder that is for us, that we are forgiven as the psalm tells us. No wonder the psalm says we're blessed. And so, friends, as we begin the journey, we do so remembering from where we have come. But we do so remember where we are going to. And so may you know the blessing of this story as we go through the Lent of 2023. God bless and take care.